Definitely feeling like winter again across southeastern Wisconsin. Now, if you're doing some traveling plans this afternoon, I think we're going to be OK. Things will change tomorrow. Now, there is some snow farther northwest, so if you are going to travel northwest, especially across Minnesota tonight and North Dakota, that's where you will find some snow for us here across the state. We're being dry for at least this evening. Things will change tomorrow. This is a live look in Waukesha. Current temperature 23 degrees. Winds are to the north northeast at six miles per hour, about 20 degrees cooler than where we were at this point yesterday. Yesterday in Milwaukee right now 26 degrees. Yesterday we were in the middle and upper 40s. We even got close to 50 degrees yesterday afternoon. So a big change, not terrible for December, but certainly colder across southeastern Wisconsin. 22 in Beaver Dam, 23 in Watertown, 23 in Sheboygan. Let's go through your weather headlines. Well, we do have some light snow, maybe mixing with rain at times in the forecast for Thursday. It's not going to add up to a ton of snow. It's not going to be a big snowstorm by any means. Now we were looking at the potential for some additional snow on Friday. However, it looks like that snow is going to track south of us. We'll watch it closely, but right now it looks to be missing us. Just a slight chance of snow for us on Friday. Now Christmas time, we got a blast of cold air. It's going to be the coldest air of this season. Storm for Max Radar, southeastern Wisconsin. All is quiet. You can see we're quiet if you're traveling down 9441 towards Chicago. If you're heading 41 up towards the Fox Valley, you might encounter a couple flurries here. As we widen the view, you can see light snow spreads all the way across north North Dakota back towards Minnesota. This is the area of low pressure that we're going to watch as it tracks towards us heading into tomorrow. So here it is on future forecast heading through the afternoon. We'll follow the time here. You can see the snow mainly across Minnesota, North Dakota at six o'clock. Now as we head overnight tonight, some of that snow does enter northern Wisconsin by early tomorrow morning. Now by tomorrow midday, we're starting to notice some of that snow spreading into southern Wisconsin. This is 330 and I think by then we do have a good chance of seeing some of that snow. Also notice the pink here indicating the potential for maybe a little bit of rain or freezing rain to mix in, especially south of Milwaukee. I think things start to taper off by midnight tomorrow night. We'll keep an eye on this area of low pressure to the south. Again, looks to be staying south of the area, but if it does track a little bit farther north, it could give us another chance of snow on Friday. How much snow are we expecting tomorrow afternoon? Up to an inch again, not a big snow for us, enough to maybe create some slippery spots on the roads. One to two inches up towards Fond du Lac and Sheboygan, maybe some higher amounts up towards Green Bay. All right, your forecast for today, 32, mostly cloudy and cooler for tonight, a low temperature of 26 degrees, mostly cloudy skies. And here's your seven day forecast tomorrow, by the way, the first day of official winter astronomical winter starts tomorrow. That'll be the winter solstice at about 1026. Let me see if I do my math right. 1026, I believe 1028, excuse me, 1028 tomorrow morning, nine hours of daylight. It's the shortest day of the year. The good news is the days start getting longer after tomorrow. 26 for your high temperature on Saturday, 23 on Sunday, some light snow. Christmas Day, a high of 10. Get ready, folks. Eight degrees on Tuesday. We could have some nights below zero as well. We'll be right back.